Did you know that flying and diving on the same day is generally not recommended due to the risk of decompression sickness? Correct, Joe. Decompression sickness, better known as the BENS, is a potentially serious condition that occurs when dissolved gases such as nitrogen come out of a solution in your body's tissues and form bubbles. When you go diving, the increased pressure at depth causes more nitrogen to dissolve in your tissue. If you then go flying right after your dive, the rapid decrease in atmospheric pressure during the climb and cruise flight can cause the nitrogen bubbles to expand, leading to decompression compassion sickness. Symptoms of the bends can range from mild joint pain and skin rashes to more severe symptoms such as paralyzes and breathing difficulties. Oh so if you are a scuba diver it is recommended to wait at least 12 to 24 hours after diving before getting into a pressurized airplane cabin. Yes, this allows your body to eliminate the excess nitrogen and reduces the risk of bubble formation. <laughs> Snorkeling, on the other hand, won't cause any problems. Now you know. <laughs> Hit the like button and follow both of our accounts for more medical and aviation-related facts.